does that really mean that you're the top? Yeah, I get what you're saying, yeah. It, does, it can't, can yeah. it? It means that one will limit the power of the other. In yeah. other words, I can only do the electric section, you can only do the designing section. Yeah, We're limited to the resources. Mm. There must be a higher power than that that actually turns around and says, I can do both of those and I'm the man to do it. Does that make sense? I agree, yeah. I... Yeah? So therefore, would you say it's logical to say there's only one God? Yeah, I agree, yeah. Yeah, one be, creator. Yeah, can only be one. yeah that's yeah. fine. Well, you know, let's, like, like I said, let's, let's take this concept and let's uh, call him God, okay? And um, therefore... Sorry. So I'm I just love a bit of water. It's getting lower. <laughs> Based on that now, when we actually take the mobile phone... All right. Yeah, you've got the mobile phone. I bought the mobile phone, and I actually looked in the box, and I found myself a phone. What else do you find in a, in a box of a mobile phone when you yeah, buy all one? The little app, all the things that little come with it. Like Go on. Directions and all the manual and whatnot. Manual, charger. Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Would you say that it's not logical, then, if we take this to a universal level, that when you buy the mobile phone, you get yourself a manual? That tells you how to run the phone. Yeah, yeah, it must do, yeah. It must do. Would you not say that it's logical then for this creator who's invented everything that you see around yourself, does it not make sense logically that he would give you some form of a manual? Yeah, he must have, because like, he would have just leave us, he would us. Why? What would happen if you wouldn't? What would happen if yeah. we didn't have a manual? We'd just be like loose cannons, wouldn't we? We would be, and we'd be lost. We wouldn't know yeah. what to do. So it's logical. Now, here's another question for you. I mean, if we're talking about the manual right now, we take the book, we open it up, we have a read. All of a sudden, it turns around and says, this Apple iPhone. What would you say to that when we know it's made by HTC? Yeah, then we know that it's, like, it's addressed to that, isn't it? It's addressed to that. Yeah. It's the wrong book, isn't it? Yeah. So this manual must have something to do with that particular phone. Yeah, I see what Does that saying. make sense? I see what you're saying. Let's take that on a universal level. We've been talking about the universe all day. Let's talk about the universe <laughs> again. You've got the whole universe, right? And we take that on a level. We must have this manual. Logically, it must make sense to everything that's around it. And it must not have any errors. Anything that doesn't make sense. Yeah, I get what you're saying. Yeah. yeah? And also, it must not have um, any contradictory terms in it. Does that make sense? Yeah, I get what you're saying, yeah. Okay, fair enough. Now, this is, I mean, we're taken out on a universe level. We, we actually, as Muslims, we actually believe in the Quran. And the Quran has no contradiction, has no errors, nothing like, you know, the Bible, for example. What, what, do you have a religion? That's yeah, what you asked me. I'm just like a Sunday grand Christian, you see. But Sunday grand I know Christian. Like, the Bible's got a lot of, like, False things in there, you know what I'm saying? You know, I've always had a bit of an issue with that, and I have to say yeah. that, you know, I don't know if you've looked on the first page of the Bible, but it actually turns yeah. around and it says, God created the darkness and the light, yeah. and then four days later, he created the sun. That's, that's a problem of four days for me, you know what I'm saying? I, I, because if, isn't the sun the one that actually gives the light yeah, of get, day? Yeah, I get what you're saying, yeah. Makes sense, yeah. right? So that's an error, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. It doesn't make sense. So based on that, we, we would have to do something. For example, would it be logical to say that mountains have peg-like structures underneath. Are you gonna get under there, mate? You can't, can you? Good point, no. very good point. But did you know that scientists have discovered that a couple of years ago? Is it? Yep, that some nice. even say that it's as tall as it is down. Sweet, that's quite big, isn't it? Yeah, and this is a miracle in the Quran. That's actually in the Quran itself. Is it? I've never yeah. seen it before. Ah, you see, have you read the Quran yourself? No, no, I have Ah, okay, 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 makes sense. No, okay, so, Going away from that, it makes sense to say that we must have some form of a guidance, call it a user manual, call it a Qur'an, call it whatever you want to oh, do. Yeah. It all makes sense, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now, say for example, right, you open up this book and it says, on the Apple iPhone, press and touch this. And you look at it and go, Apple iPhone, HTC, Apple iPhone, HTC, HTC, Apple iPhone. This doesn't make sense. No, not at all. No. What are you going to do? I'm going to check out a bin, mate. I wouldn't do that because it's a damn expensive phone. <laughs> on the other hand, what you could do, is that the back of the manual? What do you normally have? Just like a, good, a brief, brief explanation, don't it? It does. Now say for example you were doing it and you actually thought, right, this actually does make sense, HTC phone, HTC manual. Yep. And you look at it and you think, this thing here, I can see where it's coming from, but yep. it just doesn't make sense. And when you actually do it on the phone itself, you think, yeah, I'm doing that, and then I'm doing that. But it's not working like yeah, you want it to. Saying, yeah. What would you do in that instance? Oh, I'd probably get the right book, wouldn't I? It is the right book. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. So what I'm saying is you're not understanding now. Oh, I see, I see what you're saying. Yeah? So you've got the book. It all sort of, sort of makes sense to you. Yeah. You understand it. It is the right book. Right. But you think to yourself, well, hold on a second. I just don't quite understand this particular function of it. <laughs> or it breaks down slightly and something isn't working on it. What would you do in that instance? Just try to get, try to get the mechanic in to fix it. Mechanic. 
Okay, well, how about, would you not say that it's logical? Now, you know, PC world, you've got a computer at home? Mm. Ever broken down before? Yeah, plenty of times. Oh, man, what do you think of that? It gets on my nerves, mate. Oh, I tell you what, it's just a nightmare, it's isn't it? It's a money-making scheme, mate. What would you do when it breaks down? Just got to call up a technician or something. Call up a technician? Yeah. Now, let's talk about the manual, right? At the back of the manual, you wouldn't always have technical support lines, don't you? No, no. You, you do, it's, don't you? Yeah. 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 You go up and you think, right, this thing isn't working. I know what I'll do. Pick up the phone. Ding, 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 ding. Hello, mate. And you get some call centre in India normally, yeah, yeah. don't you? All them, them back, back dings, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. yeah, the, yeah. yeah. Uh, I wouldn't use that term, but okay. <laughs> Sorry, mate. Yeah. No, that's fine. But it makes logical sense to say that there must have been a technical support guy who's able to assist you on that level, right? Yeah, I get what you're saying, yeah. Yeah? So you've got someone to support you. So you don't understand the manual, but there's someone else to support you. Well, hold on a second. Let me ask you another question. Would it make logical sense then that if we've got this creator who's one, who we can't yeah, see, yeah, who's above us, right, yeah. yeah, who sent down this manual, but the manual does make sense, but it's a little bit beyond our capacity of the brain, right, yeah. especially in the fact that me and you speak English, this manual is in Arabic, for example. Yeah, I see what you said. Then wouldn't it be logical to say that we'd also have a technical support guy available to us on the end of a phone? Yeah, somebody that like, knows Arabic probably, innit? Right. Well, how about a messenger? Now, this guy was the one who actually came down with the actual book itself. He knows it back to front. In yeah. other words, they've sent the engineer to your house. Oh, right, yeah. And it's not only the engineer. I'm talking about the manufacturer. The guy who actually thought, I'm going to make this phone, and it's going to be this style, and it's going to be like this. Yeah. He has sent his top bod down to you. Nice, nice. What would you say? Does that make logical sense? Yeah, I get what you're saying, yeah. Well, this is what we believe in the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. That if we were to be given this manual and this creator was to give us any form of guidance in the form of a book, what? then we would have the messenger. And this is who Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam is. You've obviously heard about him quite a Yeah, I've heard about him, but you know what I'm saying? I just... Well, let me, let, me, let, me, let me explain something to you. The actual book itself, right, is a miracle. Now, I'll, I'll explain that in a minute. Don't worry about it. We go, won't go into it. But what would you say if I said to you that this messenger... Was illiterate. So you have a laugh. How's he going to get the book? Can't even write. Very good question. Very good question. And on top of that, what would you say if I said that on the day that he was holding his son yep. in his arms, All right. his son died? It's a pity, mate. Yeah. Right. Now, on top of that, the day that his son died, there was an eclipse of the moon and the sun and the earth. Might be a coincidence, isn't it? Coincidence. Possibly. Yeah? Could be a coincidence. Yeah, or it could mean that, he's a, that, that he is the messenger. And that even people that didn't believe in him actually turned around and said, look, the son of the messenger of God has died. And the moon and the sun have eclipsed. Wouldn't you say that's logical to say that? He could then turn around and say, look at me, I am the man, and this is happening because of me. Possibly he, could, he might have said that, yeah. If he wanted some form of fame, right? Yeah, he would say yeah. that. Wouldn't it be an opportunity yeah. to turn around and say, yeah, man, this is yeah. what I'm talking about. They don't go often, do they? Yeah. Okay, what if I turn around to you and said, he actually didn't say that? Well, and what he actually turned around and said, that the moon and the sun yeah. do not eclipse for anyone, but pray to your Lord, hmm. the one who created you. Some wise words, nice words, mate, nice words. Wise words, huh? Yeah. So it goes to show that he wasn't out for anything himself. Yeah. Makes sense? Yeah, I agree with you, yeah. Listen, it's been, does that give you an understanding of what Islam is about? Yeah, I now, kind John? of got the gist of it, yeah, kind yeah. of, yeah. What I want to do is I want to give you one of these books, a couple of these. Do you mind, do you read? Or you're yeah, reading, man? Here and there, but can I get a bit the, the one on Jesus, please, mate? Yeah, yeah, of course, there you go. Gives you a bit more about Jesus. And there's one on the Quran as well and the miracles of it. Well, oh, thanks, mate. John, it's been a pleasure. Jamil, take care, mate. Take care of yourself. You Excellent. too. I might come back next week. All right, I'll be here, I'll, I'll, be, I'll try to be here next oh, week. Sweet, mate. Thank Have you. Have a good one. Take care.